Hello, thank you guys so much for watching me make my favorite Christmas tree. It's super simple, no baking required, and you're going to get it all season long. I grew up making it, my mom is obsessed. She calls it Christmas crack, we call it reindeer feed. We sell it at Bird Bakery and our customers love it, I know you will too. So first you start with cereal. We have Cheerios, Life cereal, and Quaker Oats squares. Super simple. Then you have your pretzel sticks. You can also use regular pretzels, whatever you like. And then you have your dry roasted salted peanuts. If you want to make it a little fancier, you can go with cashews, you can go with pecans, you can go with all three, any nuts you like, that totally works. And then the M&Ms. You like to use Christmas M&Ms during the holidays. So you're going to mix everything in a really, really large bowl. And then you're going to melt white chocolate. You can melt it on a double boiler, you can melt it on a, in a saucepan, you can do it in the microwave. I'm doing it in a microwave now just because it's a little bit easier. And you want to be super careful not to burn your white chocolate. It's really easy, especially if you do it in the microwave, to burn it. If you do it in the microwave, just add a little bit of milk. I feel like that definitely helps. So you get your melted chocolate and you pour it over your mixture. Make sure it gets nice and coated. At Bird Bakery, we use the very best quality white chocolate you can buy, but honestly, any brand works. I love Calibay, but truly anything works. But again, if you, if you do do it in the microwave, just do a little bit, add a little bit of milk. You can spill cereal all over if you want. That's what I'm doing at the moment. You can get your kids involved. They love it. I honestly think it's just better to just do it with your hands. And get everything really, really, really ah, nice and coated. I'm probably doing just as good of a job mixing right now as my kids do, to be honest. Mix it really, really, really well. And then you want to take a parchment lined um, cookie sheet and spread it all out on the cookie sheet while it dries. Now you can either mix in your cranberries now or you can wait till the very end. You can see here, we have cranberries. You can also do dried cherries, whatever you like. And the M&Ms are all in there. I'm gonna kind of just assimilate this for the color. And spread it all out. It takes about 30 minutes to an hour to completely dry and it'll get nice and hard. And then once it's all spread out on the cookie sheet, I like to add either red sanding sugar or green sanding sugar over the top. And then you can also add some green and red sprinkles, some jimmies, anything to make it look Christmassy and festive. And then you wait for it to dry, as you see here. Then once it's all dried, you package it in a cello bag. You can put a beautiful ribbon around it and give it to all your friends. They will love it. It's the perfect mix of salty and sweet. You can order from Bird Bakery or make it at home, but I hope you enjoy. Either way, thank you guys for watching and the recipe is posted.